Hello, this is David Grubb from Shepherd's Loft Web Design Agency. Today we're going to do a before and after review of Cabin Rentals of Blue Ridge web design. I want to talk about web design, the usability, and also the technology that we were able to, uh, to upgrade. So first, let's look at the website the way it looked before. And so from a branding perspective, this website did not have a lot of color. Uh, we're looking at the Wayback Machine, so there was a picture here uh, before we um, built the new website. There was not a lo really a logo. There was just this typeset picture in the here over here in the corner with a cursive font, and so there wasn't really a logo per se. Uh, so branding wise, it was the layout didn't have a much color. Uh, we didn't have a a, lo a decent logo, and uh, there's not a lot. There's a little bit of story here, um, and then there's about us page that had a little bit more of a story on it. So it was kind of really lacking uh, in those in the branding area. Uh, as we scroll on down on the old uh, website, we can see here there were some usability issues. Uh, the text was going all the way across the screen, which makes it difficult to read. Um, also, there is a lot of menu options up here, which is really just distracting. And we can look at each one of those pages in a second. Then um, from a design perspective, all of the pictures are stacked over on the left side. And the text, again, the text is really small and it's gray, so it's kind of hard to read. Uh, there are some good functions here, the picture, the name, uh, and the, the ratings, the reviews over here, the pricing. A uh, little interactivity there. So green seems to be one of the very few colors that we have on the website. If we scroll down, there is a testimonial down here. It's kind of whited out and it may even been in a slideshow. So there are testimonials. So that's a good thing. And then there was this little rotating bar here, which I really don't understand its purpose. I mean, you could just click through real quickly, but uh, not a great value. There is a, a little call out here with a phone number, which I guess is okay. And then the footer uh, is has the phone number and an email address on it and a Facebook icon. So this is what the previous home homepage looked like. Uh, then the if we clicked on a cabin, so this is what the layout of the cabin looked like. There was a couple of tabs for the description, amenities, reviews, and so forth and all this looks fairly good and then you could actually select the date I don't remember there being any picture up here at the top so the focus is all on uh, just selecting your date and then the pictures were here on the left side uh, again very left side heavy on the layout and then on the right side there's this one little box here uh, where you can log in and register, but then the rest of this space is really wasted on the right sidebar. So, because there's only one item in there, then all the rest of this space is wasted. So, the layout is really, it looks incomplete or unfinished uh, in that perspective. Uh, the next page is the Our Rentals Cabins page. Again, we've got text all the way across the page, and the layout is the same. So it's, you know, something to be said for being consistent, I suppose. Uh, the next tab is, this is the cabin availability. And it's very, it's pretty cool because you can see what's available and not available. But, and, you know, that lists the calendar here. Uh, but it's very busy uh, and it's super small. So kind of hard to read. And there's not a lot of other content here. So on these pages, we have like one, one particular function. I'm going back a second to the Our Rental Cabin page. This is exactly the same as the home page. So there's no added value for having a separate page here. On the availability page, there's just this one function. There's no other words. So it really doesn't deserve its own page. There's just not enough substance here for the search engines. Uh, and then the next page over uh, the About Us, uh, there was a picture here. But again, it's so little words. There's not 400 words here. So uh, it's just another page and which could be consolidated. And then uh, the next one is the Contact Us, 
which does have some unique content over here on the left side and a form, but again, less than 400 words, not very friendly to the search engine ranking process. And then the last page is the property management page, which just has a form and one little paragraph. Another page that is doesn't really meet the minimum requirements of being a standalone page. So any one of these pages can be consolidated together with the other pages. So that's kind of the the overview of the layout and the branding on the back end. Uh, the website had not been updated in six or seven years. So the the WordPress core, the PHP, the plugins and everything were outdated. And this was a ticking time bomb. And it came down to we had the new website ready and was prepared to launch it the following week. And then over the weekend, this this old website actually just stopped working and the timing was was pretty critical for us to be able to have the new website ready and to get it to get it live before the old, the old one stopped working so uh, one of the things that we always always do at Shepherd's Loft is we've picked out a, a specific set of plugins that we know that works and they are come from proven providers or developers that or our companies and we know that we can get support for those plugins so having a a very reliable source to get our plugins and our theme from uh, really helps us with our technology stack and to kind of future proof uh, what we're doing for our customers so now let's take a look at the website that we built for the cabin rentals of blue ridge uh, so this is the home page and all of a sudden i mean the first thing is that there's color Okay, so we really wanted to enhance the branding for Cabin Rentals of Blue Ridge. We helped them put together a new logo. Well, it's a little different font. Uh, so we came off of this blue-gray theme uh, colors that she was using before and added a little cabin over here in the woods, uh, which really represents exactly what she does. Then you can also notice that on the this layout that there's not any navigation over here other than the my account and the cart page so this is very simple and straightforward there's not a lot there's not any distractions i mean there is an email and a phone number up here at the top in case you want those instead and we're just want to just call and then the big blue box here is for you to be able to punch in some dates and immediately start looking for a cabin and then you can click the search and it'll give you some results of the cabins that are available from also on the branding part of it we we added more of the story for her i uh, here in, in the gray boxes you can see that it's a good experience uh time with family and friends relaxing amazing views just pointing out some of the value of what this cabin rental uh, company has to offer and then as you scroll down you can see more of the story um, we're using an embedded font here which looks really nice on the page instead of uh, instead of a graphic or an image uh, so this is searchable content here the story is over here on the right side in a picture of, of her and her family so again we're helping and really elevating the brand with the logos the fonts the colors and the story here and then when we get down to the actual cabins that are for rent, you can see that we change the layout. We have a three column layout, three pictures across. It's very balanced. Uh, and then we have a complimentary um, payment button down here uh, it's for to pay the deposit. Uh, so then we list all the cabins here, right here on the home page. And then uh, here we have more of the story and the experience. They've been doing cabin rentals for 18 years. They have over 15 quality cabins to rent and they're a member of the local chamber of commerce. So this is part of their expertise and a part of the story. And then we have a section for her specials. And then on the old website, you saw that there was a this really busy calendar with this multicolor. So we took that idea and we put it over here. It's on a very white and gray and black blue type color theme. And you can see it exactly which uh, cabins are rented on which dates and you can toggle through the calendar and look at those 
Um, so anything in the dark blue here has something rented for it. Uh, all the gray areas are, uh, all the cabins are available for those weekends. So, so we integrated that right into the home page instead of making it a separate page. And then the next section is the testimonials. Adds a lot of value to the customer and to the search engines as well. And then you can see we built them a nice little footer here that contains their Facebook link, uh, the address and phone number on it. So this website really came down to once we consolidated all those other pages down, we really only needed to design two pages. One was the home page and the second was for the actual cabin. So here's a look at one of the cabin pages. You can see we have a banner all the way across uh, with the title in it. And then below it is actually a little gallery page where you can click through the different photos. And to the right of that is another big blue box, but you'll notice that it's on the right side instead of the left side compared to the home page. So that when you go to this next page, you know that, okay, this is a different, this is in a different place. It's a different kind of form. This is where you can actually book this cabin. So you can put in your start and finish dates right here. And be able to select your number of people. I'm just going to click some random buttons there. Close that up. And then you have a choice of whether you want to do a full payment or a deposit. And then you add that to your cart and check out. If you scroll on down the page, before every, all the pictures were on the left side. So we took it and we added a real... Uh, quality layout here using uh, colored fonts here and alternating images uh, actually image galleries where you can click through and you can see more photos of the dining hall area and the kitchen the master bedroom so there's several photos in each one of these little galleries as you can scroll through so you really can see what this cabin has uh, and if you scroll all the way down to the bottom, uh, then we have a specific list of amenities for this particular cabin. And then we have the basic rental policies. And these are in an accordion just to kind of keep the content tight. And But they're all right here. And these are global items. So we edit these one time. That they're on every single page. And the, you know, the holiday pricing is really important. So that's here. And then we added, you know, and then we also added at the top just a little explanation at the top some little instructions here and their location so very easy to navigate and use not a lot of distractions uh, very simple and clean web design from that, that standpoint the the fonts are bigger uh, and they're black uh, they don't strand all the way across uh, the pages so a lot of improvements on usability, readability, and uh, search engine optimization. So, so that's the, the before and after for the cabin rentals of Blue Ridge. You know, again, the, the big thing here was that we are using, uh, we're using technology that we know that works and that we know we can get support for. And then we were able to really enhance the branding all the way through from the, the graphics and the fonts to the colors and the words. And it all makes this website so much better than it was before. Uh, and then on top of that, we really, really wanted to make it easy to use for our customers. So this is Shepherd's Loft Web Design Agency. Thank you for watching. We were out to find websites on the brink of technology failure and turn them into something awesome.